We highly recommend you to check the settings before using this application. If you change the language in the general tab, you will need to restart the application in order for changes to take effect. It is actually good idea to restart application when you change any setting, just to be sure. You can set units for input and output values. Number of decimal places affects only output values. Calculations are made using maximum precision possible. In calculation tab you can set calculation constants. Here you can define new reference ellipsoids or edit existing ones. Map projections can be added using projection strings. If you have no experience with this, contact us and we will help you. You can restore settings to default values by clicking the reset button. Point file is the main file in the application. It contains point ID, point coordinates, point type, spatial reference system and a note. You can create point file by manually entering values. You can also import point data from text file. For this file column delimiter is a semicolon. The first row contains column names, so we need to discard it. You can copy data from spreadsheet applications like Excel. If values have comma as decimal separator, you can easily replace it with a dot. Also, you can fill columns with the value you enter. Now, let's remove duplicate rows. If needed, you can insert empty rows and add more data. In order to use this point file, we need to save it. Now, let's use this file to calculate an area between the points. You can use this shortcut to edit the file before processing. There is a shortcut to create a new point file if needed. We will use the file we filled earlier. Now we just need to enter point IDs and application will use coordinates from the specified point file. Here you can see the result. You can always check point data, by clicking on edit point file shortcut. Every table and application is exportable to the Excel and text files.